Okay, let's continue with changing the world. Just finished the uh, uranium mission now. Hopefully it's not too long until I get to a new island. Oh, what's this? Um, click on the last playthrough. My fellow human beings, on my command, multiple nuclear devices are at this moment being deployed throughout the world. The end of the world the as we know version it, of Dead Rising. is inevitable. <clears throat> and this is a good thing. Why? Look around and ask yourselves why. Three billion people live in poverty. More than two billion are without a toilet. And what is the world's most popular topic? Two billion without a toilet Images could get rather messy. Cats. The cure I all cats. is destruction. Isn't a fan. Like the mythical phoenix, a better world shall rise from the ashes. Tropico is rich. Prepare yourself. The treasury is overflowing. For day zero. And I'm sure it's just a matter of time until El Presidente no, we're still on uh, Bao Bao. Research key technology before I run out of time. Hopefully I can do that. I have a habit of forgetting my research and Day not building zero. the appropriate buildings. No, he's not named after you, Penultimo. He's named after the end of the world. Leon Kane, the man I called a friend and mentor, wants to end us all. Was he always insane or did I miss the moment when he snapped? Leon believes the only way to save the world is to destroy it and then rebuild from the ashes. A, uh, a hard reset for humanity. The bad news is that he is smart enough to succeed and possesses all the nuclear weapons he needs to achieve his goal. We have but one chance. Abraham I think I've changed the setting in video inspector and, and it crazy seems to have traveling screwed diesel. up some of the ali aliasing. The world is about to end, but <clears throat> we can still save it, just not this time around. The answer is quite simple, actually. We must travel back in time. Well, if we're traveling back in time, I, could, I couldn't do a time jump. Portal would be awesome, but I really can't go past a time vehicle. So let's build a DeLorean factory. Okay, where will I put this factory? Mm. This is my little factory area here. Got plenty of room and I've got plenty of money. So let's pull up down the uh, vehicle factory. I uh, can't fit it in there for some reason. Very annoying. And I probably can't fit it in here either. Fantastic. It's just the wrong shape. I could fit it in there if I get rid of my um, treatment plant. I wonder if it's worth getting rid of it. Probably not. I will just, what's this here? More waste treatment. I might get rid of all of these. I'm not gonna get my cash back though. Um, <coughs> Let's spin the uh, water treatment plant. Hopefully I can put another one in somewhere. Not in there though. <coughs> so let's get that uh, vehicle factory in. between the nationalists and the globalists rages on, I am putting myself firmly in the second camp. I welcome everyone to the beach and Jolly Roger, regardless of age, sex, ethnicity, religion, or even surfing skills. The only requirement is that you are cool or good looking, or both. Cool or good looking, or both. Unfortunately, I don't fit any of those categories. That's why I'm streaming a video game. So we're building that lovely 
vehicle factory to pump out our DeLoreans. And once again, I've forgotten to <coughs> look at my edicts and my research, sorry, my constitution and my research. So, where are we up to? Um, constitution options, modern apartments, bar hotel, internet, luxury flights. Um, next we will go, uh, free building, future to money, Swiss bank, Swiss bank account, and then hydroponic farm. I suppose it doesn't really matter too much. So let's get rolling. I do like that I've not got any music playing at the moment because it's going to make it a lot easier when I want to upload this to YouTube. So let's check the um, constitution. We will have subsidized media, plutocracy, 20% extra Swiss bank accounts. Uh, I like planned economy for that. And we'll go with um, security surveillance. Democracy, happy childhood, and uh, visa program. Yep, happy with that. And uh, yes, we'll let the women and children vote, or at least the women vote. I'm not going to have a male centric society here. So all citizens vote. Secular state. And I'm going to go professional army because I think we're at the points past where we need to have a significant army to do anything. I should check my, what upgrades I need to do because for some reason they seem to reset. <coughs> I can uh, produce natural gas as well. Um, less chemicals. What's my power output like? It looks reasonably good. I fully staff it and. Uh, that might give me something. Actually, the other thing I'm going to do is give myself the edict that increases the ge like geo survey is already going. Never mind, I can't do that one. I could do a nuclear test. Don't think I'll do that though. I'll do the commuting program though to make sure we get less traffic. So back over here, make sure everything's upgraded properly. Yes, natural gas again. I'm a bit unsure about that power. Uh, still 1,200 available, so I could do it. How much would that take? Not 100 watts. What's the pollution like over here? It's not actually that bad. It's much worse in this area than it is from over there. So I'm not going to use those. Make sure my mines... Water cannons. No, I don't need water cannons. Uh, what do we got here for this coal mine? No, it's fine. This coal mine, no. Quite happy to leave them non-modernized because it gives me more spots for my illiterate and poor tropican, tropicans to actually find somewhere to work rather than just sitting around collecting welfare or something. We'll do that so we get more oil. Uh, nothing to do with the nuclear program. Is that actually a military building there? Let me have a look. Nuclear program is a military building, so let's get a manager in there. Let's get the oil up a bit higher again. Make sure these two are... 
upgraded, which they are. Same with this one. Yep, lower pollution, great. Do I not have another uranium deposit around here? I do not. That's fine. Let's check the uh, logging camp is good. Llamas. We will not move to factory farm. We'll leave that. Army base is going up. Okay. Uh, I think we can probably keep going now. Uh, oh, double visitors. Yes, thank you. Uh, graduate students faster. Make sure I've got all of those sorted out. Means I get more educated citizens quickly. Um, increase pharmaceuticals, yes please. That'll increase the power of my um, clinics and hospitals, so people should live longer and I shouldn't have as many issues. Touch wood. Uh, the Rum Distillery, increase effectiveness, supply to local markets. I don't really have many in the vicinity, but it might be worth just having anyway. We'll get some cultural tourists coming to the circus as well. Sugar plantation is fine. Oh, that one wasn't. Okay, great. Llama Ranch can stay. Construction office is fine. I'll put up the Teamsters though because that'll get them to do more. Oh, the oil. Need more oil. I think we're probably ready to go from here. Won't be too many other improvements that need to go. Although I probably do need some supermarkets. Let's check what everyone's food level is like. Just want to get most of this stuff sorted out before I really get started, because otherwise I'm going to forget it. Everything's reasonable, around 50 or so. Entertainment's a little bit low, but I can drop down some entertainment buildings and uh, that will pick up very quickly, like this uh, classy looking nightclub. Of course, I want to put it right near the uh, high school, because where else would you want to have a nightclub? Actually, just across the road from the newspaper will do for now. And that should be enough to keep us going. I've got 78% for my um, <coughs> approval rating at the moment, so that again is going to work quite well. Once I get a bit more cash, I can start um, upgrading the housing, because I'm only at 50 at the moment. If I start upgrading some of these tenements to apartment buildings, that should pick up quite quickly. Actually, looking at those exported goods means I need to look at my trade. So I've got eight ships to spare. What can I export? I've got plenty of oil. Also have some natural gas. Apparel to either the US or Russia. Uh, I'll go with the US because they're a little bit higher. Could also probably export some iron to Europe. Uh, cotton and sugar. I don't know if I've got enough cotton and sugar. I'll see with those five for now. Let's check out the resources. Resources, cotton, cotton, cotton. I don't have any cotton. I really don't have any cotton. Oh, there, I've got three uh, cotton farms. None of them have any workers and they're not upgraded. Hmm. What I might do is...